Hey, this is Michael Sternberg, and this is my final summary video for the Retro Challenge 2015-01. And my project was to learn about programming using NOAA Soft's PL65 programming language for the Atari 8-bit. And my programming project was to port an Apple game, a game for the Apple uh, called Structurus for, uh, to the Atari. And so I, I think I have everything I want to do complete. And so um, let me give a demonstration of it right now. So since my last work in progress video, I've implemented scoring, level advancement, some animation when the, when the row is cleared, and you'll probably see a strange artifact, uh, like when the, when the level's complete, there's a variety of, of strange video artifacts that, that occur. And this is a, an ongoing bug I've been fighting my whole time with PL65 is that the Atari graphics mode I've been using is uh, graphics mode 10, and that's the one that lets me get this many colors easily. And there it is. Um, and and it and PL65 seems to be tampering with the priority register of Antic of the Antic chip on the Atari. And it's uh, changing my graphics mode from 10 to, to uh, various other ones. And um, I decided just to leave that in because it gives a little bit of variety at the end of the level. And sometimes it shows it properly and sometimes it shows it strangely. So that was the end of one level. Uh, so I, I think I have this working almost identically to the Apple version. And... Uh, Gonna call this one done. And I want to thank the guys who organize the retro challenge, and um, I want to thank Martin Hay for not only creating Structurus but sharing sharing his code as well. And look forward to the next one. See you guys.